Welcome to this week's Canadian Whitetail Scouting segment. Locate. Learn. Set up. Hunt. Brought to you by Muddy Outdoors. Most hardcore deer guys have already embraced the understanding of the importance that minerals play in their local deer herd. And it's March now. This is when we like to get minerals out. We run minerals all year. But this is kind of the time of year where we freshen up all of our spots. We look for new spots and we want to put minerals out. And during that process, we might utilize a bag mineral or we might utilize a block, depending on the situation. The nice difference is the block is easily removed. If you have to remove it for any reason or you want to move that mineral site, you decide later that it's not the best spot and you want to move it, all that mineral is not just gone. The bag is good, especially for existing spots where you've had a mineral spot for years. Over the years, we've also noticed the most overlooked part of mineral use is often the most important part, and that's what that mineral is designed for. So salt blocks and trace mineral for livestock, it works. Sure, it works, but what's it really designed for? The ingredients in the monster meal block and the granular loose farm are specifically designed for deer nutrition, not for cattle. One of the best parts of monster meals are concepts of year-round deer health. So whether it's the mineral, the feeder pellets, or the attractant, everything that monster meal makes is solely focused on making that deer as healthy as possible, making the deer in the area you hunt as healthy as possible. And that's gonna help that area produce the best hunting results for you, whether it's does being able to produce better and more healthy milk for their fawns, or bucks being able to produce bigger racks. At the end of the day, healthy deer means good hunting. Nobody can guarantee big results. It takes three things to make a big buck, and that's genetics, age class, and nutrition. So anybody that's claiming that they can add 10 or 15 or 20 inches to your buck by using that product, that's a big red flag. But what is certainly the truth, a healthier deer will produce a better rack every single time. A healthier deer will produce more and more nutritious milk for its fawns, which creates a healthier fawn, which creates a better building block throughout that deer's entire life. And that's your Canadian Whitetail Scouting segment for the week. This week's Canadian Whitetail Scouting segment has been brought to you by Muddy Outdoors. Share your own muddy moment.